Here comes a new challenger! Hello everyone, and let's talk about this bonus fighter. Essentially, in the Australian Nintendo website, their fighter pass is essentially put into numbers, right? So, fighter pass 1, for instance, it's Piranha Plant Fighter Pass 1. So, Piranha Plant's 1, and then Byleth would be 6, but then the next number, 7th, is the Mii costume, the Rexby costume, which came when you bought Fighter Pass 1. And, for Fighter Pass 2, it's no different. Essentially, same thing, think of it like this. Min Min is 1, and then whoever the last character is would be 6th, and then 7th would be the Breath of the Wild me costume. However, that is not the case. Instead, that number is 8th, and that 7th is this mysterious other thing. Right? And we have no idea what it could possibly be, but it's something that's supposed to be planned in between the end of the fighter pass and the me costume. So the idea here is, is that we're getting a bonus something. You get a fighter, stages, or me costume. We don't know what it could be exactly, but the theory is that, well, we're getting something. We don't know what, but we're getting something. And people are getting their hopes up and all this sort of stuff. So I just want to talk about this, really. Because I don't really like talking about speculation unless it's something like really big to talk about or people bring up misconceptions or try to hype themselves up for inevitable disappointment. Now, whether or not this is a character, stage, or me costume, we won't know. Though, if we think it's a me costume, I think it would be after the Breath of the Wild costume. So it could be just a character or a stage, or a character with a stage, or just a character by itself. Now, with that being said, if it's a stage, I think it's going to be a stage pack of three stages, because then, there you go, the stage slot screen would be complete, right? The stage slot screen would be a complete box, and that would make me very happy. It would. Or if it's a character, it could be one of three types of characters. A first party with representation, a third party with representation, or a brand new character, be it first or third party, with stage and music. You know, the first two options come with nothing, possibly music, similar to how Korin in Smash 4 came with, well, just music, right? So, it could be one of those four options. In my opinion, uh, uh, ooh, uh ooh, mm, I think people are getting their hopes up way too much for this. I don't think this is anything. I think this is an error. Because from my own research, as far as I'm aware, the other websites don't really have this issue. So, why is the Australian one the only one with this issue? Well, I have no idea. I didn't make the website. I just watched the website, or look at it, whatever word you want to use. So, it could just be an error. But if it is bonus content, then it's really, well, up to you what you want it to be. Do you think it's a stage? Do you think it's a character? Hey, that's all up to you. I mean, I can't make your choices for you. At the end of the day, it's what you personally would find hype. And uh, to me, I'm going to lower my expectations if it is something. Though I did say in previous videos that when it comes to the final two fighters, I think one of two scenarios are likely to happen. Either we get a fighter this month in May, and then the final character will be revealed at E3 with a little bonus extra, or who knows what, but maybe an extra, or both fighters get revealed at E3, that's the end. That's my opinion, but a reasonable one I'd like to think, you know, but we'll see as time goes on. After all, we are one month away from E3, we don't have to wait that much longer for our smash reveal slash reveals, perhaps. So, with that, let's keep our expectations to a minimum, fair to say. And with that, I hope that you have an amazing rest of your day. Please relax yourselves, calm yourselves. After all, I love speculating, right? I don't do it often on my channel because I don't want my channel to just become the speculation channel, but I do like doing it at times where I feel it's necessary either because I like covering characters, you know, I like talking about characters, or in this scenario where I feel like people are rushing to conclusions, hype responsibly, as they say. But with that all being said, be nice to each other, and I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Take care, be safe, and I'll see you in the next video. Thousand subs before the end of the year, eh, eh? Peace.
Anthony, I'm coming through. Partner, we can do this right. You're the fire on the wind tonight. Burning dread, ha, that's right.